with the concept of body hair and an on-off relationship with a razor. On one level, the fur is freeing and natural and awesome. On another, I still don't like people to see it. My little secret. I've been told before my size would be fine if I were taller, but looking back on that time, I know I had no weight problem at all. I had huge self-esteem issues as a teenager and battled with food, feeding off people's compliments of my slimming waistline. I've been stopped in the street when I was a skater tomboy teenager and told I was what made men gay. <laughs> my mum is a career dieter with major hang-ups about food. My dad showers scorn on people who are overweight. Massive influence. I'm less concerned with media personally now having fought against it from teenagedom in an effort to fix my body image. But I know being in the West and all the cultural imagery still sets me up to believe that only one way is beautiful. Right from the days in school, reading about cellulite on women's thighs, which I didn't even think looked bad, but got, but got conditioned to be ashamed of. I have ridiculous empathy for victims and will defend the most ridiculous person if they're being attacked <coughs> on the basis of looks or gender. Chuffing hate magazines. <laughs> <That's it. laughs>